which will be kind of sick. I got a great idea for a movie. Oh, yeah. I was having this crazy ass dream and I woke up and I was like, holy fuck, that was dope. Because, like, in my dream, it was like a movie. Was the other guy there? Nah. It, it was more so like my perspective was like I was the movie camera. <laughs> okay. So what See, was I'm the not movie? even joking. What was the movie? You got You can't just tell me that you have a great movie idea and then and then not say it. You don't have to give me all the spoilers. Like you know, I don't. I I want to. I want to yeah. be surprised well, when I see it. But the worst part was I didn't get to the ending. Well, that's where you got us. All right. Start so right taking acid. It was like a little like lake or pond or something. Mm -hmm. And there were these like purple flowers. That look kind of weird, like the tops of vibe blooms or something. That's the best way I could describe them. So that they were like kind of like starry, but not starry. And the way they worked is they would consume other like living things that were like similar to their where they were. So like if a if a flower came by because of, like the water, like uh the flow of the water, one flower would eat the other flower. But they were conscious beings. So the flower would eat the other flower, and then it would grow and start developing like to the next, like uh, stage in evolution. Again, all of the mm -hmm. So like it would eat the other flowers, and then one of the other flowers started growing like arms and legs like a starfish, and it was in love with the girl flower. So like it was grabbing other flowers and feeding her, so they would grow together. So they ended up like they ended up like escaping the pond and then they started like eating like bugs and animals and other shit and they kept growing and evolving until they became like human like and they could only die during the day but at night they would re regenerate like any damage that had happened to them so eventually they became humans and there was like this big thing happening in a park and it was going out like trying to like convince people oh yo come around the corner because they knew if they got caught they could get killed but they knew if they were secretive, they'd be, like, good to go. So they were, like, getting people, and they started killing people to take their life and make them live longer. So then these two kids saw them saw them, uh, basically sucking the life out of this person, like, until they turned to, like, bones. And they were like, holy fuck, we got to tell somebody. But at the same time, there was, like, a gang shooting going on. So, like, it was real chaotic. And then the kid ended up picking up one of the guns from the old gang members and chasing down the dude. And he knew, like the dude, the flower dude, the original flower dude, turned into a human. He got separated from the woman because the woman was sucking life out of some other asshole. So fucking the kid's getting there and the dude's trying to fight him. And then he pulls out the gun and he shoots him like six times in the chest. So the flower dude's like dying. But then the sun goes down so he regenerates. Like it's like he's shooting him just as the sun starts going down. And the dude's like feeling himself about to die. And then he regenerates when the sun fully goes down. And then he captures the kids, takes them to their house, and then starts torturing them because he's pissed at them for like trying to kill him. And then the kid was about to escape the house, which would have led into the next act. But that's when I woke up. <laughs> that's fucking great. It was why I woke up and I was like, what the fuck just happened in my head? <laughs> oh my god. 